Thank you for being a friend Travel down the road and back again Your heart is true You're a pal and a confidant And if you threw a party Invited everyone you knew You would see the biggest gift would be for me And the car attached would say Thank you for being a friend Guys, welcome back. It is Friday, January 14th. We got a ton of NBA tonight. Uh, I don't think we have any college basketball on the board tonight. Yeah, I don't think we have any college basketball. We got we got a fair amount of hockey, but a ton of NBA. And really, tonight is, to me, tonight is about trying to stack a little bit of cash so that you can go hard as hell this weekend. Super wild card weekend. The first super wild card weekend ever. This is like, tonight is like the tailgate for Super Wild Card Weekend. We're just getting all juiced up, ready to go. We got so much football this weekend, and we even got a Monday nighter for the playoffs. Bro, are you serious? We got seven teams in in each conference. I love it. Absolutely love it. I'm, man, I'm I'm revved. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. So, like I said, we're we're trying to we're trying to crush tonight so that we can just bet our balls off this weekend. So let's take a look at last night. Uh, the boys got beat up last night. It was terrible. It was terrible. Uh, Wilkie was one and two. Uh, excuse me. Wilkie was 0 and three. Shit. He was 0 and three. 8 and 19 on the month now, down 10.76 units. Chris was 0 and three. Not very unlike Chris to go 0 and three. 11 and 16 on the month down 5.46 units. Your boy was one and two. Now here's the thing. I got, man, I got railroaded on this fucking Nets bet. You know, I made the Nets bet. It was great. It was, it was a great bet. It was a great bet. And then they didn't play anybody. They didn't play anybody. So, uh, so that sucked for sure. And the Warriors stink. Like, I, Clay comes back and Steph can't shoot. Like, what on earth is happening here? I, I don't know. I don't get it. I don't get it. They, they'll figure it out. I'm sure, or maybe they won't. Who knows? But uh, in any case, I was one and two, nine seventeen and one, down five point eight eight units. Vinny was one and two. He's eleven and sixteen, down six point zero one units. Spencer was also one and two. He is sixteen and eleven, up two point nine six units. Sean was one and two. 11 and 16, down 7.04 units. And Steve was also one and two, the story of the night, 13 and 15, down 0.86 units. So that can't happen again, because like I said, we're trying to build the stack. We want to go hard this weekend. So we got winners. So let's just, let, this is going to kind of be a quick one, I think. Let's just get right into the locks. <laughs> All right, Wilkie, he's got Sixers money line and Joe over 26 and a half points. I absolutely love that bet. Uh, Bulls money line and Lonzo Ball for more assists. And Spurs plus three and a half and Darius Garland over 17 and a half points. I like that too. Chris, he's got DeMar DeRozan 20 plus and Bulls money line. Darius Garland 15 plus and Cavs money line. And then this is, this one is, is insane. Chris, Chris is so good at finding these. Seth Curry over three and a half assists. Now, depends on where you get it. And you know, we give no free ads here. But, it, it, I mean, if you want to advertise with us, give me a call. It won't be for free, but we can strike a deal. On the Barstool Sportsbook, Seth Curry over three and a half assists is even money tonight. I don't know who put that line out there, but he has hit that number 10 of 11 games, the, the last 11 games, he's hit it 10 times. The last two games against the Celtics, he had six and seven. That's who they're playing tonight. That's why that's crucial. So this is, oh boy, stack, put a stack on there. Uh, he is going 
three units on that bet for obvious reasons. All right, and I'm riding with the Sixers. I'm riding with Joe. He has been on an absolute tear. I think the last 10 games, maybe, he's averaging 31 and a half or something like that. I'm going Joe over 29 and a half Sixers money line. Uh, Steph Curry under 25 and a half. I told you he doesn't know how to shoot anymore. He's down to 33% from behind the line, not hitting anything. I'm going Steph under 25 and a half and Bulls money line. And Ja 20 plus and Grizzlies money line. Vinny, he's got Ducks plus one and a half and Panthers money line. And Bead 30 plus and Sixers money line. You know how much I love that bet. And Kings wire to wire. That means they lead from first quarter the whole way through. Uh, I, I'm not sure if you can get that on every book. Uh, I know that you can get it at FanDuel, and I'm guessing you can get it at Barstool because that's normally where uh, Vinny bets. So, but Kings wire to wire, winner every quarter. That's what we're looking for, winner every quarter. Spencer, he's got Hornets, Suns, Raptors, money line, little three way there. Sixers, Celtics over 212, and Warriors, Bulls over 221 and a half. Sean's got Warriors money line. Uh, Stars Panthers over six and a half and wild money line. And Steve, he has abs money line and over one and a half goals in the first period. Uh, Raptors money line and Cade Cunningham over 14 and a half points and Panthers money line, Ducks money line, two legger. So it's all hockey and basketball tonight, which is fine. We're coming into that season. But like I said, it's the pregame for the Super Wild Card Weekend. I, I can't stop saying that either. Super Wild Card Weekend. Like, uh, people, uh, I mean, people probably think I'm a lunatic anyway. But like everybody I talk to, Super Wild Card Weekend, Super Wild Card Weekend. Football guy, bro, 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 bro. Absolutely love it. Love, 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 love. All right, bonus first basket picks. Last night we did not hit on Will Barton or uh, Nurkic. It was Nasir Little. Oh, I'm, I'm not even joking. He doesn't hit it often, but a lot of times I'll take uh, I'll take Nurkic and uh, I was rolling with Norman Powell for a little bit. And there's somebody somebody else from the Blazers that I that I was rocking with a little bit. But I'm telling you, every time I bet them and one of my guys don't hit, it's fucking Nasir Little. But alas. First basket bonus picks for tonight. I'm going back to Embiid. I'm going back to Embiid. I know I told you I was going to stay away from him a little bit. I feel like he is super, super due. He did take the first basket the other night, did not hit it, but it's, you know, the rivalry with Boston. Like, I just, I feel like he just wants to get in there, get down on, hammer home, start the game, set the tone. So I'm going Joe. Uh, Christian Wood from the Rockets. I uh, talked about him a lot on here. Love him. He hits all the time. And I'm going Vucevic. He's just been on fire with it lately. He's been on fire with it lately. Um, he's hit a ton. In the past month, he has hit a ton. So Joe, Christian Wood, and Vucevic. All right. And what are we doing tonight? We are going with House Whiskey back on the house whiskey train the boy has been on a whiskey tear this week not gonna lie and i'm going with nugget nectar we're gonna i mean we're gonna be riding with nugget nectar till the wheels fall off i'm just being honest all right so i'm so oh so pumped for this weekend and we got six or Celtics tonight. Man, I hope this and the Celtics have not been good. The Sixers have been on a run. Oh God, I just want to beat the doors off of them tonight. Oh, then pour the shot first. No good. No good. So Steve sent us, a, or actually I think I sent it to them, something that uh, one of the books posted. Guy had a four-leg parlay. It was like two, two random-ass baskets. It was like Nets to win the first half of a game. The Kings to, to win the other night. And then he, he has 
Rams money line, Eagles money line. It's like a forty thousand dollar bet to win like like one point five, and it's got like cash out of like two hundred grand or something like that. And Steve said apparently this guy has hit multiple million dollar winners recently. So I think that means the Eagles are gonna win this weekend. Oh God, you want to talk about going buck wild if the Eagles if the Eagles beat the Bucks this weekend, look out because I'm gonna be annoying as fuck. That's a promise. All right, guys, let's get it done. great it's great um all right guys do all the things follow the social medias instagram tiktok twitter like share comment and subscribe to this channel check out the merch store we got a ton of great stuff up there working on some noobs interact with us online let us know who you like who you hate who you tell you fade you know the things we always say talk to us about strategies tell us how do you feel about our strategies tell us about some of your strategies we will be back tomorrow sunday and monday because it is super wild card weekend yeah all right guys i love you let's catch them Fuck out of me. <clears throat> Got the worst heartburn in my life. God damn it.